Instead of cutting down an old fruit tree, what if you could give it a new life? By grafting onto an established rootstock, you save time, effort and years of waiting. The strong, mature roots will push the graft to grow faster. And in some cases, you might even taste fruit the very next season. Since the rootstock has a large diameter, bark grafting is the best technique in this case. I'll be using four dormant scions for this graft. And just as I finish the graft, here comes the quality control team. There are a lot of bees living near this tree, so she probably came to do a quick inspection and see what's going on. Looks like everything is okay. Alright, now I can finish applying the grafting tape.
almost two months have passed. I am really happy to see these fruits growing so soon. But sadly, I'll have to remove them. If I let them grow now, they'll slow down the graft's development. It's a tough choice, but the sign needs all the energy to grow strong in the first year. After a few months, the tape has done its job and should be removed. If it's left on for too long, the tape can become too tight and make it harder for the graft to develop. It can also trap moisture underneath, creating the perfect environment for mold or insects. So, taking it off at the right time helps the graft heal naturally and continue developing without problems.